Our key verse, found in Job 42.2, says, I know that you can do all things. Nothing can put a stop to your plans. These plans involve you. Nothing can put a stop to the plans God has for you. Jesus is the Lord over all molecules. He is the Lord over the very building blocks that make our earth function. Jesus is the Lord, the King, over everything in our world. Jesus is able to do far more than we could ever dream or hope. He is able to make the impossible possible. Too many times we are stuck. We think, this situation is too hard for anyone to fix. But God, who is able to change the molecules of water into wine, disagrees. We tend to think in terms of the possible. We think in terms of whether it is possible for us to do it. We are so narrow in our vision that we are stuck looking at the world only the way that we see it. The problem with looking at the world through this narrow view is that we have decided that if we can't do it, then that it can't be done at all. But God does not operate that way. God does not have a narrow view. He has every view. God is omniscient, which means that he is all-knowing. He knows exactly what you're going through. God is omnipotent, which means he's all-powerful. He knows what is happening and can make the impossible possible. In the moments when we need a miracle, things aren't going well. We are stuck in a relationship storm, a family storm, a school storm, a friend storm, a storm we've created with our own lives and bad choices. The moment we need a miracle is not an easy moment, but that's when God, who is omnipresent everywhere at once, is walking across the storm and is asking you to get out of the boat. Miracles don't happen when everything is going well. Miracles happen when everything is going sideways, when everything is going poorly. But they happen in you, around you, and through you. Miracles happen when you get out of the boat. God is able to do the impossible. Let him. He wants to help. God is not done doing miracles. He is ready, willing, and able to do them in your life. The miracles that Jesus did were not the end. Jesus himself promised in John chapter 14, verse 12 through 14, I tell you the truth, he who believes in me will do the same things that I do. He will do even greater things than these because I am going to the Father. And if you ask for anything in my name, I will do it for you. Then the Father's glory will be shown through me. You ask me for anything in my name, I will do it. God is able to do the impossible, and it is done in the name of Jesus. The name of Jesus is powerful. Why not let him do the impossible in your life? God is able to do the impossible, so why stop him? Why not give him that situation with your parents? Why not give him that hurtful situation, you know the one I'm talking about, the one you don't like to talk about with people, that one. That situation is known by God and he's ready to step in and do something if you let him. Will you let him? Let's pray and talk to God about that pain and ask him to do the impossible.